Hi Pisces, this is Wendy. Welcome to my channel, Wendy's Tarot. In this video, we're going to go ahead and ask the cards what awaits for you in love for the month of May 2021. All right, Pisces, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to look at your energy first, and then I'm going to look at the energy of whoever it is that you are connecting to and dealing with in love, okay? So let's get started with your energy first. Spirit, please show me the energy of, of Pisces in regards to love for May 2021. Let's get started. First card we have for you, Pisces, Three of Swords, Upright. Oh boy, Separation, Disappointment, Heartbreak. What else? Five of Cups, Upright. This is also Disappointment, Separation, Sadness. <clears throat> Alright, and we have the Fool in Reverse. Something didn't work out here, Pisces. Um, something didn't work out you're grieving here um you know you're feeling the pain of of this separation of this loss um we will be clarifying to see exactly what happened but um i do feel like it, maybe it's something that you know you kind of took a gamble on because sometimes I see the fool as a card of gambling. And maybe it's like you made a gamble and, you know, you took a chance. And um, it's like you fell flat on your face, basically. So I'm sorry if that is your situation, Pisces. I feel really bad here. Definitely somebody broke your heart here. It does feel like you were kind of maybe... Um, um, naive a little bit or ignorant a little bit like and I don't say that in a bad way I feel like you just you were thinking the best of this person or of this relationship it's like yeah I feel like you you were you were thinking the best like I almost feel like this whatever happened was a little bit abrupt or unexpected um, that's why I'm saying, like, naive, like, um, maybe the signs were there, because I almost feel like maybe this, that the signs were there, or the red flags were there, but you didn't see them, because it's like you, like, you don't have that kind of malice, like, you couldn't expect someone, you know, to do what they did to you, so whatever that means here. Because it's like, it's not, it's something that you wouldn't do yourself to someone. Because it does feel like a deep, uh, like a deep disappointment or deep betrayal. Um, could be a third party situation here. Alright, let me look at your person's energy and then we're going to clarify those cards, okay? Spirit, please show me the energy of whoever it is Pisces is connecting to in love for the month of May 2021. Okay, first card we have is the Page of Cups in reverse. Okay, you might be connecting with a water sign like yourself, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. We also have the card of Justice upright. And we have here the Seven of Wands in reverse. I don't know, um, Page of Cups in Reverse with Justice, um, might be connecting with a Libra also. So 
So a page of cups in reverse can be an immature person, an immature energy. It could be a younger energy. Maybe there's a, an age difference. Maybe this person is a lot younger than you. I almost feel like this person took justice into their own hands. And maybe it was like a little bit um, immature of them. It, I almost feel like a little bit of a, a revenge energy here. Yeah, and like an underhanded also with the Seven of Wands. It's like underhanded, like below the surface. Like um, they were acting maybe friendly with you or they were acting... Um, you know, like nothing was wrong, but it's like behind the scenes they were um, resentful or upset or angry and they were like planning or scheming, I feel. That's a very specific message though. Um, yeah, I feel like this person feels like maybe you treated them unfairly. Yeah. Because this can be like a kid energy though, cuz this can be someone who throws temper tantrums for for the littlest things, you know. Any little thing will upset them. Any little thing will offend them. Um so it might be that this person felt offended by you or, you know, um like you treated them unfairly. And with the justice card, I feel like this person like took justice into their own hands and found a way to like, you know, get even with you. It's like, I'm not going to attack them, you know, to their face, like up front. I'm going to attack them from behind. Sick. All right, let's go ahead and um, clarify. Let's clarify their energy first. I'm going to clarify here the Page of Cups in reverse. What is this energy? Why is this card here? Spirit, please clarify. In regards to the person Pisces is connecting to in love. And we have here the world upright. I feel like in their mind, this person had ended things with you. But maybe they didn't tell you that they ended things with you. Maybe they were acting like, you know, like things were fine between you two, like I said before. But in their mind, it's like they already had made up their mind that, you know, that they were going to... Um, end this connection or end this relationship all right let's clarify justice upright spirit please clarify justice upright thank you um this is a love message but for some of you i hear like maybe you're having legal a legal situation in regards to a kid, children, because Page of Cups can be children. Maybe this is the way whoever you're connecting to got even with you by, by using children. So that's a specific message. Not for everyone. Okay, clarify justice. Thank you, Spirit. And we have here the Six of Wands upright. You see uh, what I was saying? It's like this person took justice into their own hands. And it's like they didn't have any, they didn't have the right to do that though. Six of Wands is someone who's very arrogant, who has a big ego and who thinks that they know everything. Like they think they can get away with everything, you know. And they think that they don't have to ask permission for anything that they do. So that's that's the energy i'm getting there okay so take it as it resonates let's clarify the seven of wands in reverse
clarify seven of wands in reverse thank you and we have here the six of swords in reverse Yeah, so with the Six of Swords in reverse, it represents returning back to a situation from your past. Um, it's possible that you two had separated, but this person returned back here, but not in a good way. They, they returned back to do something bad to you here. Yeah, I just feel like this is kind of like someone had a secret agenda here. Um, some sort of secret motive for returning back to you. I almost feel like they fooled you here. That's why you have the fool here. Like they tricked you or they fooled you. All right, let's clarify your energy. Let's see what the, what is this three of swords here. Spirit clarified three of swords. It's like that's what they return back for. They return back to, to trick you or to fool you, to deceive you. Clarified three of swords. Thank you. And we have here the Knight of Cups upright. Ooh, Pisces. So this is someone who you really believed in. The Knight of Cups, and you had every intention to give yourself completely to this person. Like you were, you were wearing your heart on your sleeve. You wore your heart in, on your sleeve, and that's what makes it even more, you know, painful here, because it was like you had, you were a hundred percent, you know, invested. Or you truly, your emotions were, you know, completely invested. Like you, you had, you truly had deep, genuine feelings here. And you truly wanted like a new beginning here with the Ace of Cups here. You wanted a new beginning in love. So it's like this was just a huge disappointment for you. What's, what happened to this Five of Cups? Let's clarify that one. Spirit, clarify Five of Cups. And we have here the star in reverse. So you've lost a lot of your hope and your and a lot of your faith. The star is always about hope and faith, believing, trusting. Um, so it's like you're you're in a dark place right now. You're feeling very let down. Um, you're you're not seeing the light at the end of the tunnel at the current moment. And there is a light at the end of the tunnel. It's that, that star here. That's the light at the end of the tunnel, but you're not seeing it. You're too kind of, you're too overwhelmed emotionally. Okay, let's clarify the fool in reverse. Thank you, Spirit. And we have temperance in reverse. Oh, okay. So this wasn't good for you, Pisces. I, um, this is definitely a sign from the angels that they were trying to move you away from this. From this person. I almost feel like things could have been a lot worse. And maybe you don't realize it um, because like you're really hurt here with the Three of Swords. But um, like things had the potential to be, to be a lot worse and to be a lot more tragic than they currently are. So I do feel like um, some divine energy here was um protecting you okay and things didn't work out for a reason and it, it was for your protection okay that's what i'm seeing all right pisces so that's everything let me know if this resonated if it did please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel i'd really appreciate it um and yeah i'll see you in my next video bye pisces